Yo, what up? Before I get into this video, I want to give my condolences out to my cousin, family, uh, Ernest Millard, rest in peace, cuz, and to my homeboy, Landry Jackson, a child, childhood friend, rest in peace, homie. You know what I'm saying? My condolences and prayers go out to both their families. Um, Alright, with that being said, let's get into this video. <laughs> What I want to talk about is um, online gaming, man, and how it's been for me, at least for me, in the last few months, really the last few years, to be honest, it just seems to be getting worse. You know, all these games, these shooters, well, damn near any game you play online now is seems like it's just flooded with cheaters and hackers and trolling people and just what the fuck is up with this generation bruh like I before I, I even get into that I'm gonna nip that in the butt it ain't just this generation you know what I'm saying there's people from back in my day but I promise you it's more this generation than anything. I'm willing to bet it's at least 90% this generation of gamers that's doing all this bullshit on these games. And it's bad enough a lot of these games is trash with these live... What's that live service type of bullshit? You see what happened with Battlefield 5. One more update and that shit dead in the water. And the next Battlefield don't come out until the end of next year. So, with all the fuck shit that's going on, with the development companies then you gotta deal with all the fuck shit that's going on when you get on these games they always put at least one thing in the game that shouldn't be in the game or it's OP as fuck and people are gonna abuse it and this generation I don't get it man like y'all are some fucking pussies Y'all trash as fuck, man. You motherfuckers do all this cheating and trolling shit, man. Y'all look forward to ruining people's days on the game. And I don't understand I don't understand that. Are you that fucking miserable and mentally disturbed that you gotta get on the game and fuck off somebody's experience who paid for the game? Motherfuckers hard earned money to get on these games and you motherfuckers play like y'all how y'all play? Y'all don't move. You bitches sit in spawns trying to snipe going 2 and 14 the whole fucking match. How the fuck are y'all having fun on these games? And then you got all these goddamn how to videos now. And our generation started that. I ain't gonna lie. But the way they was doing it was totally different. It was showing you how to get better at the game. The shit that y'all posting is straight cheating shit. Or straight trolling shit. How to camp. How to hold out in this. Like, come on, bro. Y'all make the games worse than what they are. People that's posting this shit on YouTube. They have a big influence on a lot of other communities of these games. And yet, they still posting all this fuck shit. Because they don't care. All they care about is they love YouTube money. And I know it's, you know, with the pandemic going on right now, everybody's practically in a fucking house. So, now you got people uploading two, three videos more than what they did on a daily basis now. And it's just flooded with fuck shit, man. Online gaming, gaming period is supposed to be fun. Y'all took or taking whichever way you want to put it y'all taking all the fun out the games y'all don't play the objective all y'all care about is padding y'all stats like go to team deathmatch bro that's what that's for to pad your stats not to play fucking conquests and uh, capture the flag type shit y'all don't 
y'all don't even care y'all just sit in the back or by the object y'all sit by the objective and just kill people that's trying to play the objective y'all some fucking pussies man and y'all do that shit intentionally thinking that shit cool and cute and that shit is gay as fuck and I'm tired of that shit on all these fucking games Battlefield 4 is the only game one of the only games I can fucking tolerate online and I've run across more and more cheaters on that now on a daily fucking basis especially on this fucking map uh, Operation Locker where you got motherfuckers hurry up as soon as the match start run to the top of the fucking mountain glitch and put their spawn beacons up there and then be right there the whole fucking match and it's just stupid I don't understand you motherfuckers, man. Why y'all do the shit that y'all do? Cheating shit is out of hand, dude. Like, Call of Duty is notorious for this shit. It used to be PUBG and GTA. GTA back in the day. Um, and, and then it was PUBG. Now nah, it's Modern Warfare. And it's not just the free-to-play Warzone bullshit. It's the whole fucking game. There's cheaters all on that fucking game. And I feel sorry for you motherfuckers that paid y'all hard on money for that game. Because it's bullshit. They talking about they fucking banned over 70,000 people. And sorry about my voice, man. I'm still fucked up about my cousin. You know what I'm saying, homie. Uh, and I just can't get my voice to go right, 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 right now. And... I wanted to get this shit off my chest, man, about this online game and shit, so, like I say, sorry about my voice, the sound of my voice, but, I'm just, I'm really tired of this shit, I, I'm tired of having to make these videos about motherfuckers cheating on these games, bro, and a lot of people that, that's casual gamers, ain't gonna really know if a motherfucker's cheating, but, I'm not a casual gamer. I've been playing games all my life, so I know when there's some fuck shit in the game, man. People say, oh, you just whine, you whatever, alright, but then when the shit happened to them, then it's a different story, and then, you know what I'm saying, but it is what it is, but these, this game, online gaming shit ain't fun no more, bro, it's not fun. You have more fun kicking it with your people in, in party chat than actually playing the fucking game. Like, real shit. And you really can't play none of these games solo. Which is what I do 90-95% of the time when I play online. I play solo. And it's it's stressful it's, this shit is worse than having a job you really don't fucking like like that's how it is playing by myself online these days because the teammates is dog shit like they horrible bruh I don't know if they incompetent or fucking ain't got no thumbs it's one of the two trust me and these ain't just kids it's grown fucking people I don't know why them motherfuckers kept laying right there. I was busting their ass all day with that damn RPG. But, um. I just don't get it, man. The, how y'all play the way y'all play and, and consider that fun. And I'll tell you why they play that way. Because of fucking YouTube. YouTube bodying these online games. Motherfuckers know exactly what to do before they even fucking had a game installed in these systems. <laughs> and that's real shit. Because these creeps on YouTube uploading all the bullshit trying to break the game because they don't give a fuck. So they figure, oh, let's find a way to ruin everybody's fucking experience. And then you creeps go on there and emulate the shit. <laughs> it's crazy. I can't even throw out my mind is fucked up right now. So forgive me if I'm going off track, man. But like I said, I just want to get this shit off my chest, man. Because I'm tired of getting on the game 
and going through the same shit on every fucking game. And then if they not cheating, they got fucking $200, $300 controllers. They got the fucking Cronus Max, a strike pack, a body controller. Like, you got to spend so much money just to compete online. And then these motherfuckers don't even play the objective. This shit's crazy, bro. Like, I shouldn't have to spend no more than what I spent to get the system. Whether it's Xbox or PlayStation or hell, even PC. I shouldn't have to spend no more than that to enjoy the game. But no, I gotta get fucking a strike pack or a fucking Cronus Max USB stick or a fucking $100 headphones or more or a two, $300 controller or more just to fucking compete because you fucking creeps are so scared of losing on these games or dying that y'all go to the highest fucking power or whatever the fuck you want <laughs> y'all go y'all got fucking PC monitors playing on console which is a little lag you know edge for the lag or whatever less lag or whatever fuck I mean y'all got everything dude just look back and some of you motherfucking creeps out there just sit back and look and how much fucking money you spent just to try to be good. And some of y'all are still garbage truck juice. And y'all have spent all this money. Like you dudes is creeps, man. Like I was in a party with a, with one of my people, man. And his guy came in and he was talking about some chick that they was playing GTA with and they was all in the same party and she had him muted and he lag switched her just because she had him muted what type of motherfuckers is y'all that's some whole ass shit that's that's whole ass shit man and that's the mind state of you motherfuckers online these days y'all some straight up cowards non-combative fucking pussies Who's scared to move around on a fucking video game? Fun for y'all is hiding in the window or in a corner aiming down sights for fucking 10, 20 minutes, 30 minutes. Y'all some bitches, man. Get off the fucking game, dude. I'm tired of this shit. Fuck niggas play like pussies, man. Real shit. I'm out of here. Shows over, motherfuckers.